Okay. <laughs> Hi, and welcome to my really, uh, this is going to be kind of jerky, but, uh, yeah, hi, welcome to my newest build. This is something I'm working on at White Springs. Not sure if I have a name for it yet. So it's just like a little cottage at White Springs. So you can start out back here where I did a little workshop. I need to add a little bit more foliage around it and sink it a bit more. But for right now, we're <laughs> going to go with that to try and camouflage that. Um, I put my little workbenches in here. Yeah, you know little lights and stuff just merged a, a generator in there for power uh yeah i'm still not good at this freaking controls uh anyway yeah there's a i just put all my stuff in, you know a little stuff in here you need to do crafts and you go back outside here got my all-important rad stag for all my you know carry weight needs and then this is the back of the house. Here's what it looks like from down here. We tried to do some different angles and use the different windows. And I really like that uh, set we got today with all the flower with the roses in them. There are two si kinds. There's the one in the planter, which I have on the ter uh, little kind of thing I did there on the back instead of a porch or stairs up there which I might change but I kind of like how this looks kind of looks like a a little you know topiary type thing I add some more plants if I can my budget is almost completely taken up by uh, back here with the roses I have to I have to scrap some stuff so yeah that's what it looks like from the side from the back and then yeah I just put up my little doggy doggy and my all important seared my lurk flays for more carry weight. And this is what it looks like from this side. Um, and then, you know, we come up around here. And this is the back. And right here we have our laundry room <laughs> and our generator. You know, fusion core recharger in here, all important. You know, it's like a little utility room on the back of the the house where I, I did my friend rabbit steel help me with this with uh having this sticking out here it looks really cool so and the color matches like with the the theme kind of you know back here it looks like a little robot face <laughs> and then over here on the other side it's you know like kind of like the same pattern as the other you know looks really nice from up here there's some stuff that needs fixed like that back porch isn't flush you know um now I'll work on it and I, I tried to get this to look even but I couldn't get the trees just perfect so you know it is what it is they're a little overgrown okay we're gonna go with that I'm gonna mess around with them some more and see if I can fix it so these come in here this is my entranceway. You come in here and there's my little kitchen. Remy, don't hit my hand. I'm trying to steer here and I'm in the floor. Okay. <laughs> there's my little kitchen and you know, they have the little lights there. I like the green. Uh, they look real nice. I think I have them turned off so you can see the green more. They just stand out better. And then my little wine rack, of course. Uh, Grandma. Grandma, what are you doing? Grandma Junko, where are your clothes? She does not like that pink outfit I put on her today. I bet if I came back, she'd be wearing her old green dress. All right, Grandma. So, anyway, I mean, I just put, like, a lot of nice flowers out. Lots of flowers. A little display. My little work area over here. And, of course, my vendor with my crappy stuff. But, whatever. I'm on a lower level of uh, count. Um... Of course, I have my all-important canned coffee for my caffeine needs. And then there's my little kitchen. Um, whoops. Oops, I went up too far. All right. <laughs> it just, it's real simple. I just merged the little stove in. have my various oils and spices, spices to cook with. And some cake for visitors and little flowers on the counter there. I just merged that down in there. Yeah, it's not anything fancy. I didn't do a lot of merging or anything on this. Except for I put that dang turkey in there. See, he's like, how you doing? 
anyway, <laughs> I wish they'd give us something where it looks like you can, you're baking something in there. So it's like really open. There's a lot of empty space, but I don't care. Let me get up here so you can see it better. Um, yeah, so this is the upstairs. And I tried to do it just real, uh, I wanted a lot of nice open, you know, like loft almost. I didn't think, I didn't want to bother with inside walls because it would have taken from my budget, honestly. I, um, I, yeah, so I sacrificed that. And it's, you know, I put the, I love this display case. It's so cool. You can put a lot of stuff in there. I didn't put my Fabergé, Fabergé Deathclaw eggs in there on this, but I should have. Anyway, yeah, that's, so this is the upstairs. Grandma wanted to be on film again without her clothes on, obviously. Um, I just, I don't know. I didn't merge a lot. I'm gonna, I gotta straighten up these flowers over here. On the, I can see that. That's why I like doing these or document what I am doing. And I have a couple videos. I need to go back and update some things at my houses and then show it. And why is that not lit? Huh. Oh, well. Anyway, that one's supposed to be lit, so I'm not sure why it's not. What happened? Maybe I need to repair something. So, yeah, so anyway, so let me go up here, <laughs> and, uh, yeah, something isn't connected here. Huh, I wonder what happened. That is so weird, like, why is that not connected, even though it is? You can see my wires, even though it's so badly wired, or is, yeah, it's connected, what the? I don't know. Anyway, well, yeah, both of those lights are usually on. It looks a lot better. So how is... Is that light on? Yeah, that, but this one's not. What the hell? No idea. Okay, well, I'll have to fix that. So this is what it looks like from above. I'm just really, really, really happy with how this turned out. I think it absolutely looks great. You know, just really nice really nicely decorated and just I just like the layout too I'm gonna I'm definitely have to blueprint this um yeah it's just really nice and open pretty I might put something over here I don't know no I kind of like it like this I like it it's just not too much just pretty and neat so yeah so I hope you like it and um once I update it, I will uh, um, uh, do that video. Yeah, I have to fix this right here. I have to fix that. It's a little bit too far. It's over just a little bit, and I can't figure out what's doing it. I think it might be... I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. So I'm going to have to try and figure it out and fix it. So, yep, there is my uh, villa. <laughs> or not villa. This house at White Spring that I tried to work, uh, do some different angles with and make it look more interesting and not just a plain house, you know, use like nice, lots of light, nice glass, and I really like the pine, but not, you know, too much pine, and of course, stop cat, and of course I did use the, um, roof, the, the pine roof, that that's the log cabin roof, so, and I get a skylight, like, and I, I like to put these, because I think they look like lightning rods, kind of, I don't know, I like them, they look cool, so, anyway, yeah, that's my little house at White Spring, um, stop by, say hello, thanks.